Hey guys and welcome to our first look at Astroneer! Yes, I threatened it on the stream and we're gonna go ahead and do it. I have literally not even watched anybody else's Let's Plays for this at the moment, so this is gonna be an exploration extravaganza of trying to find out what's going on in this game, which means it's gonna be super cringy for, your, for you guys, surely. Um, okay, so we are some guy that's been launched from an orbital ring, that's nice. We're coming down in our capsule upon a slightly polygonal world. Oh, a bit of the frame rates as it loads up, but I suppose that is to be expected. We're on a blue and orange world. Amazing, amazing. So I'm tabbing for this dude. Movement WASD, that's all good. Can we jump? We can jump. Can we click and do stuff? There's an exclamation mark over there. Oh, that's just pointing. Okay, cool. Terrain tool. This sounds like something we can deal with. Shape it. Okay, so le left clicking seems to pull away. That's nice. Oh, I like that, actually. Uh, what is the depth? What, how deep can we go? You know, you know what I'm going to say here. Like, are we going to be able to go all the way down to the surface? Uh, to the core, even. Oh, I took some health damage from doing that. No power? Oh, that's not good. Especially as I've dug myself into a small hole here. We must be able to dig out, right? Uh, so the power is actually more of a... Um, fatigue? Something like that, because, wow, uh, we, we wore out and got some back. So, I didn't see any bar. Oh, look, okay, so there's an energy bar on the backpack here. That is funky. I like it. So we've got a couple of uh, circly things. This guy wants me to go get some resin. Right click for the camera, of course. Should we go and uh, go and see if we can get some? Is it only with the, the tool? No, it's not like that. What does a right click do with the tool? <laughs> right click does the camera. I knew that. Okay, so let's get rid of that, that tool. Can we... How do we interact with this node? Are these resin? Are these the resin? Must be, right? So oxygen at 50%. I don't like that stat, actually. Uh, so we break the ground underneath the resin. Yeah, okay. So now that we've got that, it's telling me that we need to queue for backpack. I think we might take a moment to look at these clouds, though. Wow. That is a nice cloud system. Uh, my backpack is telling me that I'm running out of oxygen. I don't see any marker for 25% oxygen. Maybe it's the blue bar there, but who knows. Okay, so we've got solar, compound needed. We've got some resin there. That's nice. Um, what do we do? Okay, so it snaps in place like that. Solar is not a thing that's done. I'm suffocating. How do we stop suffocating? I'm going to try uh, going back to the, to the uh, capsule. Seems to be where I would keep all my oxygen, right? We can extend this. How do we extend this? Now I'm going to press tab and get inside. Okay, so that saved it for us. Okay, so first off, I'm really liking the, the surrounding. I'm liking how customizable the game is, how like the terrain features work. It seems very intuitive, just the, the left click. I haven't figured out how to put stuff back. So right click to extend this. We've got a resin common. Now is this going to grow me some resin? Or is this just storing stuff? So I've built a compound of some description from my cu capsule. This is nice. Uh, more resin to do stuff with. Um, ooh. Ooh, I wonder what we're doing here. <laughs> I really don't know what this is. So we're making platforms out there, but... So we need more resin to do stuff? Is this what I'm reading here? Is this what I'm reading? I think it might be. Has my oxygen been recharged? Was it that blue bar on top? Okay, so yeah, we found this bit up here. I'm not sure what... Ooh. Okay, so I can just click on myself. And we can look. Compound, tethers, tank, generator. There appears to be a whole load of stuff in here. Wind vane. We need some aluminium. Oh, is this a crafting bit? We need some compound for the solar. Lithium for a battery. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Okay. Uh, how do we get outside? Brilliant. Okay, I don't. One thing I dislike, just as a general rule, um, when you're inside a menu and you press escape and you end up in another menu, that that's, that's rubbish, guys. There's <laughs> just a little bit of personal prejudice there. Now, what do you reckon this stuff is? So my oxygen is once again running out, and yes, that blue bar at the top was definitely the uh, indicator we're looking for. Not much actually going on at the moment. Um, we're just. Well, I suppose it is really the tutorial moment. So we got some power. This is power crystals. Is is that what we're getting here? Maybe, maybe. And what's this stuff over here? So I'm guessing that all the different... Yeah, so this is all power as well. So, so far I'm picking up yellow is power, blue is buildy stuff. There's some bright blue stuff over there. Let's see if that holds out true. 
Um, we've already filled the backpack up with power modules, you see that? So this blue stuff here is oxygen. That's great. I, I could do with all of that. Um, so look, on the backpack, we've already filled up with loads of power stuff. Um, and the oxygen appears to be building up on the back of our terrain tool. I don't know if that's a thing. What do you reckon these are? Can we get any stuff here? It's not really telling us. So once we get a load of things... So we got organic. Let's uh, press Q to bring up our backpack. Organic, here we go. It's a resource. Can we put it down on the floor? Is that what I'm seeing here? Not really, no. Um, so organics, what's this? Power resource. So I'm feeling a limited uh, number of categories of stuff. So in this resin patch, it appears that we can dig down deep and, oh, I've just realized that I'm completely running out of oxygen. So let's get back to the thing. So there's, oh no! Well, there's a death. We'll figure out how that works. That guy had a lot of stuff on him. So I appear to be tethered when I'm close. Look, you, you see this? We've got a little little line of neon coming out to me. So that that's, that's an interesting thing. Do you reckon that death marker over there will have a load of stuff at it? I kind of hope so. Look how far that tether extends. Okay. Uh, are we going to find a backpack? We are going to find a backpack. So that's nice. We can go and pick up the stuff uh, that we all that we uh, picked up. Now, how do I claim all that? Oh, did I just throw it around? Okay. Let's just let's just throw it all on the floor. There must be a nice way of putting this in my backpack. Uh, I can't figure out what it is though. So we're just going to drag and drop it all onto the floor. I kind of want to just put it on my ah so some of them do go onto mine if i do click them onto me but some of them just seem to drop on the floor as well can we steal the body we can't steal the body um resin common there we go the menu sit not the menu the uh the inventory system's a little bit weird having to pick up items from the floor and then kind of drag them into your slots here uh, also, eight slots. That's not really going to be enough when I want to want to go further away. How do I increase my oxygen stores? Oh man, this this is not good. Like, I'm not going to be able to make it like over to those mountains at this rate. I am going to try seeing what we can do with some of this stuff that I've got built. Um, now, does it need to be resin for all of the? Oh, we're saving the game. Cool. Does it need to be resin to uh, extend all these out? So, yeah, it does want resin here. I can click on that. Is it just storage? Is that what I'm reading here? So we can send that resin out there. What does it do? Oh, oh, wow. Printer. Copper needed. So we need to go on a, a, a massive tour for for copper. What What's this one going to do? Uh, we don't have any more resin. So resin is the issue. Let's uh, Let's collect up a whole load of resin from that hole over there. So what I am wondering is, can I drop some of this stuff just on the floor here and then it will be around for me to collect later? I hope so. I do hope so. The generator is copper needed. Um, I'm wondering how I put the plans down for that sort of stuff. Like, does my selection here change what gets made on the, on the ship here? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so I went out and got another stack of resin. If I click on this, what happens? It goes out, uses all the material, and then makes another two-tier bit. Okay, that, that's fine. I mean, it's it's all good, but we kind of already knew that this was going to happen. Um, definitely need more, more resin. What happens if I come over this way? What's the blue flowers? Is this still just organic? It is still just organics. So that's unfortunate. I was kind of hoping the different color flowers would give us different colored uh, material or different types of materials, different categories. Um, it all seems to be just the standard, though. Okay, so we've had uh, base building-ish. We've had materials gathering. Uh, oh, and we have some stuff floating away. You all right there, buddy? What's, uh, what's unsettled you? Maybe it doesn't like being stacked up. So I'm trying to find some more resource. This, this is definitely the thing that we need here. I am feeling uh, massively limited by the amount of oxygen I've got. Trying to head out and see what's going on. Uh, is a very scary thing because not only do I need to have the oxygen to move out there but uh, having the oxygen to do stuff as well out there and back is like easy to judge you just walk until you're down at 50% oh look there's loads of resin here this is what we need uh, yeah walking out there and back is easy just wait till you're at 50% but now look using this tool appears to use some of my oxygen look how fast it's going down whilst I'm doing this compared to the um, the rate it was dropping whilst I was walking is ridiculous. 50% oxygen already. Already. I'm suffocating already. Ah, I've got to run back home. Oh, thankfully it's okay. But wow, that, that was difficult. <laughs> so, um, 
The whole cutscene interacting with objects is a bit weird. It almost looks like that's got no gravity being uh, applied to it. That's interesting. Still no copper found, though. Still no copper found. All right, guys. All right. Yeah, I totally had completely missed the fact that this one here has two little arrows on it. So we can make some research or a smelter, which sounds good. Like, that sounds like something we could do, do with. Vehicle bay or printer. Now, I don't know what the printer does, but it sounds like something we could probably do with. Sounds to me like something that's going to make things for us i'm not sure what research also sounds like something we need compound needed we haven't found any compound yet have we um no no so i'm, I'm guessing oh look what does this do no that's just a build button i was kind of hoping this was an eye um but no no vehicle bay for aluminium and printer is copper okay so i think we know what the vehicle bay does that that's kind of don't tell me oxygen at 50 percent. so i've noticed that um when i'm close to these things look i'm, I'm still tethered so we could kind of build over towards some of these lovely little bits over here. So that, that, that could be a thing. But I'm going to go look for some copper or for some aluminium or something like that. There's, I'm going to walk over this way, which for now we will classify as east. Over that way is north towards the mountains. I mean, these are mountains as well, I suppose. Uh, I'm going to watch my oxygen bar, just hoping against all, all possible hope that we can get to something. What's that over there? No, it's just buried uh, oxygen and power. But there appears to be a massive lake. Uh, not lake. Was Ow! I keep forgetting that going downhill... Uh, sorry, falling any amount of distance hurts. Uh, so I've just had my 50% oxygen. Uh, I, can't, I can't go in. I cannot go in. We're going to have to try and run away out of here. It's getting back to the ship. It's getting back to the ship that's the problem. All right, cool. Thankfully, there's a load of oxygen here, so let's get out. Oh, we're suffocating already. Man, okay, so there we go. The moment we start mining this rock, we can get some oxygen back. Running out of power, though, but power is not a thing. Can we get an entire stack of oxygen back? That That's what we want here. I uh, just want to be able to fill this up. No, that's it. No power, but more importantly, no oxygen is left. And I think we're going to waste more oxygen than we are going to harvest there. They're... Oh, there was oxygen just in the wall of the canyon, though. Let's go and have a look at that, shall we? You know, when you're recording, you kind of just get blinkered on the information that you already have. So I could just remember that oxygen was back there. I forgot that we'd already seen some other oxygen here. I wonder if they stack... Is, is this oxygen? Yeah, it is oxygen. Look, it's all going inside my, th inside my meter. So let's go down this way. Do you reckon these rocks destroy into anything? Do they do anything... No, you can make them fall over and break, but nothing actually happens. So, big cave. This is something new. What's inside the cave? So we've got some oxygen and some power nodes over there. We've also got water. Ow. I fell. I fell and it hurts. Is it water? No, it's just ground. Oh, okay. So it's not as good as I was hoping for, unfortunately. We've got some stuffs here. This is like life stuffs, if you will. We've got like oxygen and power, as said. Okay, so I've got a little oxygen node to carry around with me. Oh, look, there's green things here. Is green new? Oh, 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 what's what's damaging me? Look at these clouds. These clouds are full on throwing me, uh, following me. We've got some malachite. Okay, that's good. Like, seriously, leave me alone, please. Wow, okay, we found a big hole. So is malachite deadly? Is malachite a problem? Let's go and have a look. So copper ore, let's try and break this down. Man, yeah, I'm taking damage. I'm dead. I'm already dead. Okay, so we need to do something about that. Wow. Wowee. So we know that where copper can be found now. That is one of the good things about that. Before I wrap up, I think we're going to do one quick, almost Zerg-like rush on that Malachite to see if we can get some of that. Um, because I'd like to get the, at least the vehicle bay on display so we can have a look at one of these buildings being finished. So there's the hole we dropped down, but what is that over there? Let's go get some oxygen. And maybe I'm not going to go check out that Malachite as much as I would like to. First, let's go and get the oxygen from over here. It's just hidden in the floor. Okay, so I'm not... Now that I've been out and had a little bit of explore, I'm not so scared about the oxygen levels anymore because you can just find some lying around. Oh, let, let me out, please. Uh, so Malachite appears to be found underground. That's good. But look, look at that. It's um, a crashed solar station of some description. I mean, we've got some struts. We've got some massive solar panels. Uh, oh, I am running out of oxygen, though. Is there any over here? I, I kind of hope there is somewhere. Can we break this apart? 
Oh, is the beeping's getting more insistent. I think it really wants to kill me. I'm just about to run out of power. Oh, I really wanted to undermine that and see what happened. <laughs> oh, all this time and I didn't know there was a sprint key. Um, it appears to be eating through my oxygen as the rate you would imagine. But yeah, there we go. Who, who knew that there was a sprint key? Look, over there, there's another crashed thing on a mountain. Oh, there's there's things everywhere. Oh, we've got to learn to look up every now and then and look at the distance. I've also noticed how fast we're spinning. Uh, this planet must be spinning. Because look how quickly those, those stars are going past. That's amazing. Okay, we're going back down into here. So the Malachite was deadly. Uh, it, it gave us, like, poison uh, effects. There's got to be an easier... How do I put stuff down? Uh, so, aluminium. Let's see if we can't get some aluminium ore. This is this is nice. Cool. Awesome. Lacquerite. Okay, nice. Let's go and get some more oxygen over there. Power's just over here. Look, hydrazine. We can get some hydrazine. Oh, that is some high-octane fuel right there. Let's see what we can do about this. I mean, I only really want... There we go. The one node, if you will. So, coming down into the caves seems to be the way ahead. What is this? Can we... Oh, ugh. Uh, what are you? Oh, wait, leave me alone. <laughs> I may have disturbed something that I'm not ready to handle. Um, okay, so let's turn around here and get ourselves a little bit more oxygen and continue this exploration. Here we go, malachite, copper ore. This is what we need. We want all of this, like all of this. Um, I can carry a lot. A bit more malachite. I wonder if I'm going to need the smeltery to refine malachite down into copper. I've got a feeling I will. got a feeling I will. Okay, let's try and find our way out of here. Oh, man. Where's the way out of here? Okay, I'm going to go up. Oh, no. I'm going to go up through this oxygen patch here. This is what we're going to do. Oh, death, death, death is coming for me. Uh, let's keep going up here. Okay, so I found a layer of different colored stuff. Here. Oh, no, no, no. Is that stars? No, that's not stars, is it? Are we outside? Are we not? No, we're not outside. It must just be a weird graphical bug. I wonder why that's on the go like that. Oh, man, come on. Are we going to die? Oh, we best not die. Okay, I'm going to have to go down for some more oxygen. It's going to have to be. It's just going to have to be. Okay, so I've got all the oxygen I can lay my hands on. I don't think it was anywhere near enough, but those gla gas clouds were totally doing me in. Uh, we're back down to 25% oxygen. I just hope we can dig out in the time it takes us to get up there. Look at the stratification, though. The, looking at all these stars in the background is a little bit disorientating, though. I'm sure you guys are feeling that as well. I do apologise. I'll try and get us into a much nicer situation soon. Is this surf? Oh! Oh, we, we fell. We died. Oh, well. Well, I suppose I'm just going to have to go and get all that stuff now. So it might not have been stars. Look, this this ground sparkles as well. Oh, get away with your oxygen demands. Wow. Okay, so in here we have a body. Give me that body. I need, I need the stuff. Let's put this away. Okay, uh, what I wanted was not the hydrazine, it's the malachite. The malachite is what I'm particularly... No, on there, please. So you pick up with a single click and then drop with a click. I was trying to click and drag. Uh, that was why I was being so painful for me. Okay, let's try and get back. No, not not like that. Just, just run away. Just leave it. Be gone with you. So I'm a little confused why they give you um, power crystals to try and, like, mine and pick up. Because, like, you, you'd want them to repower your mining as you're mining, right? But the only way to do that is if you're mining the power crystals, which kind of, you know, is a self-fulfilling, defeating pro process. I, I just don't get it. Just don't get it. Okay, so printer. We don't want the printer. I think what we want is the smelter. We need some compound for that. Now, thankfully, I just found a whole load of compound. What I'm going to do is drop the hydrazine because, you know, that's, that's totally not what we need. Um... The aluminium ore and everything we are going to have to try and sort out at some point. Now, where was it? That that was the compound just over there. Okay, now the real question is, can we use this compound that we've got floating here in this construction? Let's try it. Let's try it. Yes. Yes, we can. So can I also do this? All right, that's how we build compound. Um, can we get rid of that? So is that is that it? The smelter build? Yeah. Oh, look at it, guys. We, we've built a thing. We have built a thing. It's got no power. How do you reckon we build the power? So we need some resin for that, right? Okay, so if I have got this correct, we put our second bit of resin in there. That all gets processed down into making the base template for a building. And then we should somewhere... Oh, we don't have a power unit. 
Oh, oh, I bet I know what powers you... Ah, oh, look, watch. Okay, so we take... Oh, have all the powers disappeared that I had here? Oh, you, you guys remember I had some power here, right? And it was floating around. So yes, indeed. I mean, it's put the backpack on totally the wrong side of my screen for it, but we can do that. Okay, let's put the power crystals in there. This is powering up nicely. So how do we put the malachite in? Ah, look, look at that. I see. So we take the malachite and we pop it into this little uh, socket there. Looks like the whole game works off of a, a socket system, which I, I can get behind. I can get behind. I kind of like that. So there's the three bits of malachite. Can we also then put in the aluminium? Is that gonna is that gonna be weird? Is it gonna do weird things? Let's press this button and see what happens. Okay, yeah, we've got some refined processes going on. We can pick up the copper, put it on our backpack, bring it over to this printer schematic, pop them down in there if I can. I can't see what's going on. Guys, they, they, they need to sort out this particular menu system. Oh, wow. That, that could definitely use a little bit of work. But once we've got that going, I will say... I think that's a good first look at Astroneer, guys. Thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. If you really did enjoy it, give us a thumbs up, a comment down below, and I will know to make this into a full series. I'll be honest, I'm kind of umming and ahhing about it at the moment, so let me know what you think. But I will see you then when we're going to maybe do that. Bye! There's no wave emote. I'm going to have to work that one out.